This made possible by Valsang. By this I mean my dad, porque Valsang son los padres de ella. And a long time ago, Bill inventó la compañía Valsang. Tienen dinero. Espérate, espérate. Also brought to you by Acumi Miami. The year was 1989. No, what the hell is wrong with the right foot? There's too much space there. That's crazy. Okay, in a little hospital called Mind Sinai, a little princess spectacular croqueta eating girl named Marta Valdez was born to Ruben Valdez and Marta Valdez. Since a young age, Marta showed very little signs of intelligence about it, saying things like, I used to think that Lake Okeechobee on the map was my pool. <laughs> what the hell? But she always stayed hungry, not only for croquetas and café con leche, but so that one day she could be an entrepreneur just like her father. And sell Cuban bread shirts on MarthaMiami.com for $24.99. The high school years were a little confusing as you can see. Volleyball player didn't lead too much. Had a lot of friends, not a lot of boyfriends. She was like the nanny of the group, imagínate. Hung out a lot with her sisters though, Carmen Hernandez and Ellen Valdez. Fast forward a few years later, she really started coming into her own about 15 years after her 15s, which leads us right here to the Mata of Miami 15 celebration, almost at 30. 